Attempt to back. Race one. The pet fair slumped up Philly Stakes over Mal, listed for four years up. Disappointing field of just four winners on the dirt. Donkeys on the sand, as I like to call them. I'm not very fast on racing on the old weather. Ain't half bad. Oh la la, supreme gift. Wing Gotters, a quick bet with. David Kingston, Neil and Mesrick and David Undy are the four trainers and the orders and off over this mile for fillies and no level break really Wing Goddess just probably just ahead in front from Hula La La and then Supreme Gift ain't that bad of being held up that mark of the fall so cat and mouse show sure then so and Wing Goddess as jockey has decided that the pace was too slow when it started to go on. Leads by two lengths from Supreme Gift to La La. And Ain't Half Bad is just about marker. They're going towards the five. Um, week one, a week, the week of the Guineas. And the big new market two day meetings. Uh, Wing Goddess leads by two lengths from Ooh La La, Supreme Gift on Yena. And Ain't Half Bad. But they now come towards the three and a half marker and he's trying to steal either from the front wing goddess. The jockey trues quickly up all the time, leads by a length now, pushed along she being gift in second. Oh la la, running around a bit in third and that means ain't half bad as they come around the outside for a wide to come and towel and make it a challenge. We're now heading towards the two and they're swinging in near the Kempton Park and the wing goddess is still holding on. She's about a length and a half to you, ready to take you. In some service, same supreme gift. Um, ratings, you think you'll allow be the one to be the, <coughs> the one to make most of this chance, but no, it's Queen Goddess by a length from whom supreme gift coming to challenge, and he's held on. He's made all Queen, Queen Goddess. Made home, way home, to win by half a length. And then now we able to get back to her. In third was uh, ooh la la disappointing. Fourth was ain't half bad.